Hello, everyone, and welcome to the MathBase.com Anacast series. I'm your host, John Cassidu. In this installment of the Algebra series, I will discuss algebraic techniques, part four, multiplying and dividing algebraic fractions. As we saw in part three, algebraic fractions have variables in the numerator or in the denominator, or both. 1 over 3x squared, z cubed over 4, 3xy over 2z, and u are all algebraic fractions. The last because any variable, u in this case, can be written as an improper fraction with denominator 1. Any two algebraic fractions, p over q and r over s, are equal to each other if p times s is equal to r times q, provided that neither q nor s is equal to 0. To multiply two algebraic fractions, first, completely factor the terms of each fraction. Reduce both fractions to lowest terms, and then multiply the factors of the numerators and those of the denominators. For example, to multiply 3x over 4y by 2y cubed over 9x squared, write each number as the product of its prime factors, if necessary, multiplied by the product of the factored variables in each term, to get 3 times x over 2 times 2 times y multiplied by 2 times y times y times y over 3 times 3 times x times x. Cancel all common factors in the numerators and denominators, which will leave just 1 in the numerator of the first fraction and 2 in the denominator, and y times y in the numerator of the second fraction and 3 times x in the denominator. Now separately multiplying the numerators and denominators of the two reduced fractions, we get y times y over 2 times 3 times x, or y squared over 6x. Generally, any two algebraic fractions can be multiplied using this formula. The formula can be extended to multiply as many algebraic fractions as necessary. These formulas will work for any algebraic fractions provided that none of the denominators is zero, but the results will usually have to be reduced to lowest terms. As we discussed in fractions part two, the reciprocal or multiplicative inverse of a fraction is one over that fraction, or what you get when you flip it, so that the numerator becomes the denominator and the denominator becomes the numerator. A fraction and its reciprocal always have a product of one. The reciprocal of three x over four y is four y over three x, and the reciprocal of two y cubed over nine x squared is nine x squared over two y cubed. To divide two algebraic fractions, Multiply the first fraction by the reciprocal of the second. Let's divide 7m squared n cubed over 4a squared b cubed by 21mn over 2ab to the fourth. The reciprocal of 21mn over 2ab to the fourth is 2ab to the fourth over 21mn. So the problem now is to find the product of 7m squared n cubed over 4a squared b cubed and 2ab to the fourth over 21mn. Writing each term as a product of its factors, we have 7 times m times n times n times n times n over 2 times 2 times a times a times b times b times b, multiplying 2 times a times b times b times b times b over 3 times 7 times m times n. Canceling the common factors, we are left with m times n squared over 2 times a multiplying b over 3. The product is m times n squared b over 6a which is also the quotient of the original problem. We can generalize dividing one algebraic fraction by another using this formula. This formula works for any pair of algebraic fractions provided that the denominators of the fractions are never equal to zero. 